starting off with my road trip makeup, I'm going to be taking my Maybelline cover stick and applying that on the very inner corners of my under eye circles because this is where I seem to get a lot of a purpley color and it makes me look extremely tired and this really creamy formula of this concealer really helps cover that up and it's a great concealer for on the road. Next, I'm going to be taking my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder and an e.l.f. foundation brush and just buffing that in on my product that I just put on under my eyes. And then for filling in my eyebrows, I'm just going to be doing the normal thing that I always do, which is taking my Naked Basics palette and just lightly filling that in for a little bit of color. And then taking my Anastasia Clear Brow Gel, I'm going to be setting all of that product and shaping my eyebrows. And now for the rest of the face makeup, I'm just going to be taking my NYC Smooth Skin Bronzer and applying that into the hollows of my cheeks, my temples, and down my neck for a bit of a pre-vacation glow, if you know what I mean. And now taking my Benefit Posy Tint, I'm going to be applying a little bit of this to my cheeks for a little bit of a rosy color. look I did very very minimal eye makeup so all I used was the Maybelline color tattoo in barely branded and then for eyeliner I took my Sephora brand black waterliner and applied that just on my waterline for a little bit of dimension and it made me look like I spent a little bit more time on this makeup look than I actually did and then to finish off the eyes I used the mega plush mascara by Maybelline and this is my all-time favorite it adds a lot of length and volume and makes my lashes look super good and then to top off the look, I use my Dandelion Lip Gloss from Benefit, just for a little bit of shine, and it smells so good. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna do for your hair is you're gonna gather all your hair to one side of your head and then begin twisting it from the root to the tip. And then once you've done that, you're gonna wanna twist it until it forms a bun on the side of your head. And then once you've secured it with as many hair ties as you need, all you have to do is stick in a cute clip or bow. And if you want to know where this one is from, it's from Botiki, and I will have the link to the website down below. Okay, and for the outfit, these really cool genie-like pants are from Brandy Melville, and they're just black, and they're super comfy, so they'll allow me to sleep in the car. And then this crop top is also from Brandy Melville. It's extremely soft and really easy to move around in. And then this bow, like I said earlier, is from Bow Cheeky, and honestly, I wouldn't tell you guys anything that isn't true. These bows are amazing. Okay, so my first road trip essential is hands down my sunglasses because you never know how sunny it can be when you're on the road or if you're driving, you never know how sunny it's gonna be. And my other essential is definitely a magazine. So if you're a passenger or you're in the back seat, you definitely want something to keep you entertained. And if you're done with your magazine and you wanna get a little bit of shut eye, then you definitely need one of these neck pillows. And if you happen to pass by something that's a little bit pretty, then I always need to have my Polaroid camera just so I could snap a picture of it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, just like I always ask you to. And don't forget to check down below and check out Botiki because they are really great. Bye. <laughs>
Oh my god. 